I had one in uh, the late 1960s. At that time, I was in my early 20s. I was in the United States Navy, and I was at a weather station in Iceland. You know, that's where they sent me. Mm-hmm. It could have gone to Vietnam or something, but they sent me to a weather station in Iceland. So I would have some free time, and once I went with some... Uh, friends of mine camping in Iceland in the mountains of Iceland in the 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 winter time and you know, we were in a tent at the base of a small mountain not a huge mountain like Mount Everest maybe a few thousand feet but you know covered with snow and ice and we had this idea well let's go out let's race up to the top of uh, the snowy mountain in the moonlight so Yeah, there were three of us, and we went out, and we started going up, and I was winning the race, kind of, and I got up to the top, and I was almost at the very top of this mountain, and I slipped, and I fell down on my back, and I started sliding down the slope, and I tried to stop myself, try to dig in my heels or whatever, but I kept going faster and faster and faster. And I was just thinking of all the sharp rocks I climbed over, the cliffs. I thought any second my skull is going to split open, I'm going to go over a cliff or something. And at a, a certain moment, I just mentally let go. And when I did that, I experienced an NDE. I experienced, well, an out of, maybe an OBE, out-of-body experience is a better word for it. I you know, experienced myself outside my body and I could see my body going down the side of that mountain and I blacked out and then I hit a snow drift at the bottom and you know my friends kind of shook me and woke me up and said the only way you could have come down alive was the way that you came down otherwise you would have been dead.